Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon Ultra Sun. Randomized! I'm your host with the most, Dairy Dancer, the Double Ds. And when we last left off... Oh, yep, called it. Cutscene with this guy. Got a rival here, I'm assuming? <laughs> hey, hey! <laughs> Which Pokemon are you going to choose as your partner, have you decided? Oh yeah, I'm Hal. I couldn't wait for us to pick our partners together, so I came to find you myself. That's an annoying voice already. More. Whoa, your litten is so cool. Hey, wait, you already picked your Pokemon? Sorry about- oh, oh that's Kukui. Crap, what was his voice? Oh yuck! Sorry about that, Hal. We had a little accident on the way here, so I ended up letting Dirt Dancer choose his partner first without you. Yuck. Fair enough, I guess. I guess it was just a fate for you guys to meet. But you can choose one of these two, how? Huh? Bark. Then my partner will be Rowlet. I choose you. Hoo hoo. Alola, friend. I've decided. Oh wait, I got. I almost got a little kukui in there. <laughs> I decided ages. Oh, I, I already forgot it. Dang it! I decided ages ago that you're the one I wanted to have an adventure with. We're gonna do so much awesome stuff together. Just you wait and see. Professor, you'll take good care of Poppy, all right? You better believe it, Huck. I will, Hal. All right then, Pablo, everybody. Time to get back in your balls now. <laughs> Wait up. Me and Rowlet have a favor to ask. Be our opponents in our first ever Pokemon battle together. Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay, so I got Mudcap. Or Mudcap, I think. Yes, Mudcap. Uh, what did Hal get? I'm making too much noise here. All right, seriously, gonna enjoy this. You were challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hal. Pokemon Trainer Hal sent out Rowlet. Oh, it was Rowlet. Actual Rowlet. Interesting. Oh, that's right. We screwed up with the name Loud Bive. Uh, let's see. We got Water Gun and Tackle. Ooh. That's going to be a problem. <laughs> Loud Bive, don't. We can't white out again. We whited out last episode. The fans are very disappointed in you. Okay, we're good. We're Gucci. Is that what the kids are saying nowadays? Gucci? <laughs> Whoa! That was awesome, Dare Dancer. You and Linton are both so cool. You've got to have the kind of battles where everyone has fun. You and your partner Pokemon too, you know. Yuck, right on, Dairy Dancer. You and Hal both brought out the best in your partners. And pulled off some spectacular moves, yeah! Eeky Town is right up those stairs. Come on, Dairy Dancer. <laughs> you should totally check out Eeky Town. Thanks, Hal. I love you. I want to see what's over here first. Oh, Paralyze Heal. That's good, that's good. Let's see if we can find some red. Oh wait, we don't have Pokeballs yet. Mmm. Lichen Rock. I love the music. Oh. Oh. Alright, let's just go. See what's up. Another cutscene. More crappy voice acting coming from yours truly. And we're here! This right here is Eeky Town. This town is where folks come to worship the Pokemon that watches over Mele Mele Island. Tapu Coco keeps us all safe and happy, see? Well, I saw a super depressed dude looking over the edge. It looked like he was thinking about jumping and a wingle flew by. That was kind of cool. Actually, it was kind of a cool wingle. I kind of want to go back and catch that. Uh, oh yeah, and of course, you know, <laughs> be there for the dude that's gonna 
jump. Uh, I guess there must be some trouble somewhere on the island that needs fixing. Yeah. Question mark. <laughs> yeah. The Kahuna wandered off without a word to anybody, singing a little ditty or something. Screwed up that. That's good. I'm going to go stomp home for a second. I've got to show my mom Rowlet. She's totally worried about me, like, all the time. She says, why are you wearing black with yellow pants? You look like a doofus. And I'm like, Mom, I'm just trying to be myself. Step off. Oh, my. Going to pay your respects to the guardian deity? It's a fickle one, but I hope you made it. <laughs> Screen just zoomed in all dramatically. I thought something else was happening. <laughs> I love these games. I don't know if I talked about much last episode, but I freaking love Pokemon. I've been such a huge fan ever since I got my Game Boy Color and Pokemon Red when I was just a wee lad. I know, I know. I'll take you to the ruins. Please stay in the bag, Huck. We could get in trouble if anyone sees you. That voice hurt. Not gonna lie. How you all been? I hope you're doing well. I'm doing pretty good. Working a lot, as always. You guys already know that. I talk about it every episode. <gasps> it's a Cosmog! Oh, snap. Um, hmm. What am I going to say to you? Uh, don't worry. Cosmog's not being attacked by Spearow or anything behind you. Hmm. Uh, who are you? Never mind me! You have to help me, please! Safe, Nebby. That thing? It looks like it's doing okay by itself. <laughs> Pew! The spear are attacking it, but I'm not a trainer. I can't. Please, please save Nebby. I'll heal your Pokemon for you, so... Oh, fine. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, a Spearow, look at that. Wow. Oh, wow, it's not a Spearow. <laughs> That's a legendary Pokemon. Um, Azelf, level four. Uh, water gun. Okay, okay, not bad, not bad. No, 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 not confusion. Don't be confused. Oh, thank you. Oh, come on. Water gun him. What does that do? Nothing. Ha ha! Loser! What if it been a tougher battle if it was a Spearow? <laughs> oh, yeah. Level 9, baby. So OP. I don't even have Pokeballs yet. Alright, level 9. That's just a sign for how tough this randomizer is probably going to be. I'm going to die a lot. You managed to chase off one of the Spearow. <laughs> but oh, there are still more. You know what? I feel that that statement was very condescending and I don't appreciate it. I feel like I'm putting my life at jeopardy for nothing. Absolutely nothing. Please, please help Nebby if you can. But be careful. It looks like that attack may have damaged the plank bridge too. Oh, okay. Oh, yep. Oh boy. No, thank you. Don't worry, I got you, bruh. Oh man. Can't you just, like, yeah, that? Oh wow. <laughs> Whatever that was, why couldn't you have to. Whoa. I am Goku. I am a Saiyan brought to Earth from a pod from my home planet. Bye. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Laters. Pew. Oh, oh, thank goodness. You tried using your power again, didn't you? Oh, Nebby. You dumb idiot. You know what? Happened last time you used it. You could have moved for ages after that. Idiot. I don't want to see you like that again. No, I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Neb. Dude, Nebby's not even talking back to you. You're just screaming at it. I know you 
you were trying to save me that time? Ugh! You're always so selfish! That couldn't even help you in return! Okay, okay, whatevs. Don't give me that sass! What was that? <laughs> pew pew! A sparkly stone? And it feels warm somehow. Hey! I think that Pokemon pooped this out! Please forgive me. I'm so grateful for helping us out on you, blah blah blah. Are you the kahuna? Get in there. Hmm. <laughs> um I'm worried we might get attacked again by some wild Pokemon or something. I know it's too much to ask it, but do you think you can sit back to town? Show me them Pokeballs. Whoa, okay. Oh, it takes so long to get these games started. Oh, Daridanza, you already met Lily, huh? She's my assistant, yeah! Lily, I thought you were the Kahuna. Kahuna, holla! He said that he had something... Oh, wait. Dang it. Kahuna, holla! He said that he had something to attend to, so he left town on his own. I was just, um... Taking a little stroll up my hollow trail while waiting for him to return. Please don't spank me, Daddy. And that's how you met our dude. Wait, what did you just call me? David answer. He just got to a lowly yesterday. Help him find his way around. Yeah, yeah. So you're just also one of the professor's acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. All of my girl voices sound like that weird perverted guy from Family Guy. The Kahuna's back! Kahuna Hala has returned! He's a savior! Oh my goodness! I'll suck your dick! Look at that swagger. Have I missed something? There you are, Kahuna Hala! Was there some kind of trouble? Oh, ha, ha, ha. Just caught up in the middle of some brawling ruck rough, that's all. Sorry, Lily. What were you saying before? For some reason, I thought I saw Tapu Coco flying about. Oh, um, yes, Kahuna Hala. Nemi got attacked by some Spiro on the plank bridge. And, uh, Derry Dancer here helped me protect it. But the bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall to the bottom of the ravine. And that was when the island's garden duty swooped in to save them. So something about being Goku was saying for, I don't know, he was kind of weird. Whoa! That's something you don't hear every day. Goku? Oh, although it is said to protect us, our Topokuko is a rather fickle creature. Yet our guardians moved to save you. Kukui, my boy, I think we have cause to celebrate. Bring me a full rack of ribs. <laughs> ASAP. Looks like we have the brave kind of new Pokemon trainer in our midst. I'm glad to meet you, child. I'm Hala, the Kahuna of Melamela Island. Welcome to Alola. Young Kukui had told me of your coming. Has handed down in the ancient, ancient scrolls. Young Kukui had told... Oh, wait, I already read that. Sorry. I'm glad we got the chance to meet today. Oh, when did you get out again? I told you to stay in the freaking bank, you idiot! I know the Kahuna Hala and the Professor will keep you safe from any harm, but you really should stay in that freaking bag. I mean, I don't lug this thing around for nothing. Look how ugly it is. Get in the bag! Safer that way. Anywho, Nebby well, it seems to have taken a liking to you. Uh, I have read that Pokemon like it when you put them take, or when you pet them, or take care of them. Oh, you know, I'm not a trainer. All right, here's a lovely gift for me to you to help make today's special, Dare Dancer. I don't know if you can tell, but I don't really read these sentences. Whoa. A Pokedex is a real high-tech kind of tool, yeah, that can automatically record facts. About any Pokemon that you meet. Your new partner, Litten. Oh, uh, Kukui, it's a Mudkip, please. His name's Loudbife. It was supposed to be Loudbird, but I screwed it up. 
Your new pot in Lytton is already registered. Oh, yay! Uh, so check it out. And this is the trainer passport that I had put together for you. Well, you gotta meet the coon at least. Bye. I hate you. Oh, dang it. Oh, yeah, Dairy Dancer. Hold up a sec. My mom thought my Rylet was super cool, and I'm here to battle you again, even though you just totally swept the floor with me. Uh, what is it, How? Did you forget something? You're seriously asking me that? Who's the one here who forgot to tell anyone before wandering off for a little stroll? Oh, and, uh, saying without a word, huh? Hmm? Oh, Dairy Dancer. Would you be so kind to give me a look at that sparkling stone you have there? Could it be? Tutu. Tutu, isn't that... You were rescued by Tapu Koko at the bridge. Isn't that what I heard, Dairy Dancer? Yeah, it rescued me. No big deal. Shut up, old man. I just want to get going on my Pokemon adventure already. Oh, I hate this so much. Perhaps you are here in Alola, Dairy Dancer, because this is where you are meant to be. Allow me to borrow the stone for now. Fret not, I'll return it to you tomorrow evening. You have the makings of a brilliant trainer. I can see that light within you too. You must do us the honor of joining in our festival tomorrow. Okay. I can't, I can't, I tried, I tried, I tried so hard, I don't know. Oh. Alright, so I just skipped all of that. That was a lot of boring cutscenes, a lot of BS, so we're just going to cut that out. And now we're going to see what kind of random Pokemon we can run into. We got ten Pokeballs from the pro... Is that Suicune? That's a Suicune? That's a Suicune. That is a Suicune. Uh, so I don't know if you knew this about these games or not, but 100% catch rate when you first start. Boom. Didn't even have to weaken it. Just caught that. Just caught a Suicune. The legendary roaming Pokemon Suicune is now part of our party. Probably not going to use it because I don't really like legendaries. I don't think they're that good all in all. And they don't evolve. And I like having people or Pokemon that evolve. I want to find some like decent Pokemon that we can actually like start getting a party with. Build a, like a bond. Oh, another Pokeball. I want like Pokemon we can build a bond with. I want them to evolve. I like feeling attached to my team. Like we've been through the really knit and grit of life. And I don't feel like I can get that with the Suicune. We're just gonna run. Oh, what is this? Hey, what up, beautiful? It was love at first sight. I knew I needed to have you as my wife. When the eyes of Pokemon trainers meet, you know what's gonna happen, right? They're gonna screw! We're gonna have hot Anywho, it's a Pokemon battle. Oh, okay. I whew got me all hot and bothered there. You were challenged by the last Audrey. Got a little Buniri, what level are you? Got a level ten mudkip. Oh, level three? Are you kidding me? Don't even. Don't He had me at half chub, now I'm at nothing. What a gun! Blech. Oh yeah, get wrecked. Lap five. I love you. Oh, your Pokemon look so happy that they've won. Ugh. Dang it. <sighs> Alright. I'm gonna end this episode here. I hope you liked it. If you liked it, like it. Subscribe. I love your face. Gonna pick up the next episode with this cutscene. Mwah, mwah. I don't know why I did that. Anywho, deuces.
Testing, testing, mic one, two. Gonna play some Pokemon Ultra for you. Hope you're excited. I am too. Gonna do some Pokemon catching. Hoo hoo. I think that's good for a test. Uh, let's see if that worked.